Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Katie and I am a nail technician and my channel is all about nails. I recommend a lot of different products and today we are gonna be diving into the Daily Charm Mystery Nail Art Box for spring. So I'm very excited. I have no idea what's in here. It is still sealed. I haven't even opened it. We're gonna see what's inside. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more videos videos and if you love nails you love nail art then this is the channel for you and I think you're gonna really enjoy it first of all if you haven't heard of daily charm they carry like a wide range of nail art products as well as gel polish and now they have full cover tips lots of different art products charms stickers glitters foils I feel like they have a lot of unique items and then I also love their gel polish line. So their gel polishes look like this. They're in like a nice slender bottle and they have the name of the gel polish on top. And I have thoroughly enjoyed their gel polish and their gel polish is also available to anyone. Anyone can purchase their products on their website so you don't have to have a license to use their products. So let's go and open it. Uh, to start with, the mystery box starts at $49 and I believe it is a hundred and twenty dollar value so it's 50 bucks and you're getting a hundred and twenty dollars worth of products so let's go ahead and open her up here first of all it has this gorgeous gorgeous like floral print on the box and it says daily charm and you gotta love nice packaging right Okay, so we have some a gorgeous like pink stuffing that's really cute. And so that's really pretty and it's like nice and shimmery too. So we're just gonna move all this. Ooh. So we have a nice little card that says Daily Charm on it. And first thing I see here is some dried flowers. So dried flowers are great for spring. I use them springtime almost every year since I've gotten dried flowers. And these ones are really pretty. They're like a nice pastel color. They are bigger, but you could totally encapsulate like some of these just bigger leaves and they would look really pretty. So we have a lot of different colors, good range of pastels in this. So that would be fun. And let's see, oh, this looks like a little pin, like a little floral pin, that's cute. I might add that to my apron because I have some pins on my apron, but that's just a little kind of extra little gift, I think, a little pin. All right, so here is a glitter mix and this one looks like it's all pastels. Oh my gosh, so pretty. It's not super, super like chunky glitter. It's like a nice kind of medium sized glitter. It's like the most gorgeous pastels. Oh my goodness. Like that is so pretty. There is some like fine kind of like shimmery glitter in there as well. So really fun, pretty glitter mix. We have, looks like a little duster brush or a little powder brush. Uh, looks like we also have a little soap here. Diving into some more glitter here. Ooh, these ones look like fun. Okay, let's see what we got. So we have six glitters here that kind of fit into the spring season. Let me move all this. Oh yeah, this is like their pastel glitters that are kind of, some of them are shimmery and some of them are more matte, but they are really pretty. So this is a really nice pink shade. Okay, this next glitter mix is another pink, but it looks like it has some different shapes in there. Let's see, let's pour a little bit. Ooh, okay, so we got some bright pink, hot pink glitters with some white, some stars, some butterflies, some little triangles, some little flower glitters. Like those are adorable. So this is really fun, bright pink and white. I definitely don't have any glitter that looks like this. The next one we have, this one is gonna be just like that first pink one that I showed you guys, but it's in a pretty blue shade. So it's got like some kind of more matte sparklies and some just regular glitters, kind of chunky mix in like a nice blue. Oh my gosh, this one is so fun. 
this is like a serious like party party glitter oh and i just yep i just did that blue flowers pink butterflies green butterflies gold big gold circles blue glitters all sorts of like fun there's some silver in there i think oh my gosh i definitely don't have any glitter at all that looks anything like this and this is super fun i hope one of my clients chooses this because this as like a encapsulated glitter fade or something like how fun with this and i'm totally gonna make a huge mess of all this glitter but that's fine because how else are you guys supposed to see it like look how cute that is on the table i love these like neon colors they're so fun okay this next one they are sealed with this little kind of sticky tabs Ooh, this one's pretty too blue sparklies with some white stars this is honestly like this shade of blue like a periwinkle like blue is one of my favorite colors like i absolutely love it uh purple is my favorite color uh but periwinkle is probably close second which you probably wouldn't know because my room is pink oh shoot oh i can't be trusted look i'm just creating a whole nother glitter mix on the table don't mind me I'm just making a mess. Um, this next one looks to be like that other pink and blue one that I showed you guys. That's kind of got some of the matte glitters in it. Ooh, but it's like a deep kind of bur burgundy maroon color. I don't know if I would call this spring, but I think that it could definitely be used in springtime because everybody has an idea of what colors they want to use for spring. So, so pretty. Okay, so that's the little glitters that have come in there so six glitters and then plus the big pot of this kind of pastel glitter mix love 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 and i spilt half of it on the table so today's going great moving on here we've got looks like some actually let me clean up this desk because i feel like it's gonna be really distracting <laughs> i got it mostly cleaned up we're here <laughs> so this looks like some like embellishments charms things like that so we have a nice pretty like pastel crystal mix there's just some like light blues actually they look like the um kind of opals so there's the opal the blue and the green this is a really really thin paper you can use kind of like glitter or something and it has butterflies some flowers, some leaves. It even looks like some of them are like holographic, have like a nice holographic like reflection. So cute. Uh, we have some embellishments, some flowers. So it looks like there's some little flowers and some bigger flowers in there. We have some really beautiful butterflies. Like, hello, those are gorgeous. I might need to put those on my nails. And then here we have some just gold roses, which you could use these any time of the year definitely so there's all of looks like embellishments or crystals we have two gel polish colors and i don't have either of these so that's awesome let's see the first one is number j08 Ooh, and it looks like a nice creamy peachy pink color except it almost looks slightly sheer like it might be more actually because it has a j that might mean jelly it might mean jelly don't take my word for it but i'd have to look it up afterwards but so it does look slightly sheer like it's not going to be like a cream color that one's called ballerina and the next one is called wonderlust and the the number is g21 and i actually saw someone else get this exact color in their box and when i went because i was like i have never seen that color before on the daily charm website when i went and looked they actually didn't have it on their website so i don't know if it's like an exclusive to getting the kind of mystery box or what but it it looks oh yes that is such a pretty like iridescent glitter it's like green blue pink it looks like from the cap because half of the cap is white and half the cap is black 
it looks like it's gonna look more like this color if you put it over white and then it looks like if you put it over black it might be more of like orange yellow kind of so those are the two gel polish colors that came in there and looks like we have some more embellishments okay these are adorable they are tiny little embellishments smaller flowers and bigger flowers and then there's also some gold little bouillon beads in there and they look so cute so i think i've seen them the pictures of these they would lay the flower in there and then they put a bullion bead on the inside to make it like the middle of the flower these are adorable it looks like we also have a little kind of fluffy brush in here you could use this to apply glitter and last but not least we've got some stickers i think this is like real shell like i think if i bend it it's actually going to like crack or something so that's cool we've got a floral foil here it's got kind of pinks and purples and yellows with some leaves and we have some stickers we have this one that has kind of frames in it with the kind of flowers inside of the frames we have oh i like these ones a lot we've got some blue flowers some white flowers and this looks kind of like a bluish purple like periwinkle color like a darker blue and some gold stickers that are butterflies so that is really cool let me just double check if there's anything else there's nothing else in the box so to kind of summarize what we got here we've got three stickers a foil of shell foil two gel polishes we've got one large glitter mix and we've got six smaller glitters we've got a brush we've got some pastel little flower embellishments we've got some bigger embellishments like a variety and some crystals we've got these dried flowers and we've got a couple little gifts here a little brush some soap and a pin so that's everything that we got which i honestly feel like if you are like needing a refresh for the season like you're like oh, i'm just not ready for spring i don't have stuff for spring or summer whatever season it is this is like a really good variety of stuff that you're gonna get in this box just like kind of fun to see what you get and a lot of the stuff i actually saw in the new arrivals section on the daily charm website so a lot of this stuff is new to the daily charm website and then you would get it in the box which is cool and i think they only have a limited number of the mystery boxes every season Hey guys, I just wanted to pop on here and say that since filming this video, this box has actually sold out. Uh, so they only have limited quantities, but they still have a lot of the stuff available online to purchase separately. So I'll make sure and link everything down in the box below. But if you are wanting one of these mystery boxes in the future, in different seasons, make sure you jump on it because they do sell out fast. Okay, so the one other thing that I wanted to share that I got from them, this has not come in the mystery box. This was just separate, but they have released a new edition of their uni chrome unicorn chrome and so we are going to try that out today if you look at the bottom oh my gosh it looks so pretty okay so they have had this chrome already but they've just re-released it so that it is shinier and smoother and even better than it was before so i'm thinking of trying it on my nails for you guys and just kind of showing you what it looks like let's open it up here whoa whoa okay i cannot today oh yes look how beautiful that is we are going to try that today and i'm thinking of doing a little nail art on my nails and we'll just do the one hand just to try it out um so what i'm going to do quickly is just kind of prep my nails a little bit so that i can apply this on top and then we're going to see what it looks like and how easy it goes on so uh, i will be right back really quick gonna get myself all fixed up on my nails so that they are ready to go to have the chrome applied also if you're unsure on how to apply nail chromes i do have a video all about chrome how i apply it how i keep it from chipping and how i keep it lasting on my clients three to four weeks so make sure to check that video out if you're unsure on how to apply it or if you're having trouble with it or need troubleshooting and stuff like that so great video 
I've got all the information already down for you in that one. So first I'm going to apply my no wipe top coat for the chrome to adhere to. Okay, to apply my chrome, I'm just gonna go in with a little eyeshadow sponge. And again, I did my nails last week, so I just feel like somebody in the comments is going to like talk about my cuticles or whatever, but these are not fresh nails. These are a week old, so cuticles are not perfect anymore, that kind of stuff. So I cured my no wipe top coat for 60 seconds, and I'm just going to stick my little um, eyeshadow sponge into the powder and just rub it on and oh yes that is stunning sometimes chromes if they're not very good can look kind of grainy this one is like smooth as butter like that's so pretty and it looks really nice over that kind of like nudish pink color. It looks so pretty. It's definitely like a smooth, smooth buttery chrome. Like that's gorgeous. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna top coat this and then I wanna do just a little bit of nail art on top just to kind of like jazz it up. Oh my gosh, like in not even the direct light, just in the like room light, so pretty. Okay, I've got my nails top coated now, and the reason I top coated them before doing the nail art is just in case I mess up on the nail art or I wanna wipe it off for some reason, I won't disturb the chrome or I won't mess up the chrome. So the chrome's been top coated, it's stuck in there, and now I can do the art on top of it. So basically what I'm gonna do is I just wanna do some daisies because I think that would be cute over chrome and I've never done that before so I'm just gonna use some white gel paint and I'm just gonna paint some daisies. Okay, here's the finished nails with the chrome and the daisies painted on them. I think that they are absolutely adorable and this chrome is so buttery smooth. I love it, it's gonna be a new favorite. Again, this is called the Unichrome, Unicorn Chrome from Daily Charm. And this is a chrome that you could apply over every any color and it's going to enhance the color or change it slightly, but you're still gonna get kind of that color showing through underneath. And so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the kind of mystery box. It's kind of fun to unbox something when you don't know what is gonna be on the inside. Again, you can get this from dailycharm.com and you don't need to have a license to purchase anything from their website. And it's so fun, lots of nail art products. Love this new Chrome. Daily Charm's just knocking it out of the park. So, and as always, you can use my code KD10 to save yourself 10% off of anything from Daily Charm. So it is a nice little deal there. And this again was $49 and it is $120 worth of stuff. So it's a really good deal if you kind of like surprises or like to have like a mystery box type of situation. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed already. I see you guys. Don't forget to follow me on my social media and I will see you guys later. Bye!